first uh, car of any kind. The Model S. This is an ambitious goal to create a whole new kind of car. A lot of Wall Street is betting Tesla can't get it done. So, uh, you know, what we really wanted to achieve here is like, well, why, you know, why make this really fast car that's crazy fast and everything? And uh, I think there, there is something it, it, that's quite important um, to the future of sustainable energy, which is that uh, we've we got to show that an electric car is the best car, hands down, you know? So, it's, it's got to be clear. It's like, man, this is... Uh, Sustainable energy cars can be the fastest cars, can be the safest cars, uh, can be the most kick-ass cars in every way. Um, and that, and that's, that's why we did the plaid. It's just to show hands down, this is the way to go. Huge improvements we've made. So, so and it started off with, with good performance, but uh, now with, the, the, with plaid, we, we've managed to break the, uh, the, the two-second barrier, if you will. The, no, no production car has ever uh, done zero to 60 uh, in yeah. under two seconds. We also were able to achieve the uh, lowest drag coefficient of any car ever made. So, yeah. So, uh, really, I think t Tesla engineering has outdone itself here. Uh, this is a car that looks good, but also gets an, uh, an incredible drag coefficient. And this is, uh, take, this is the, the true drag coefficient of the car, including um, with wheels in motion. Sometimes you'll hear drag coefficients quoted, but that'll be without the wheels moving. And the wheels cause sort of air churn and incremental drag. We also have the latest uh, and greatest uh, in heat pump, which is the, basically the HVAC system for the car. Uh, it's 30% better cold weather range uh, and requires 50% less energy for cabin heating in freezing conditions. Um, yeah, so it's, you'll see very little degradation uh, in maximum weather. safety. As uh, in fact, this is designed to be the, uh, our aspiration for this car. Um, it still has to be tested by the U.S. government, but uh, we think we can uh, get the, the lowest probability of injury of any car ever tested. So, um, in fact, the, these are the actual NHTSA probability of injuries numbers. All top five cars the, with the, the lowest probability of injuries ever tested, all five are Teslas. So, so I mean, with the Plaid Model S, what you have is a car that is uh, faster than, than, quicker than any sports car, uh, and it's like faster than any, any Porsche, safer than any Volvo, in the same car. That's insane. It's like, it's like you know. <laughs> yeah. So. And then the design, we've obviously made a lot of refinements to the exterior, and, and then we've made, we've completely redone the interior. So we, we, I think when, once you drive the, the new Model S, it really feels like you're driving the future. Um, and uh, other cars are gonna, especially like non-Tesla cars are gonna feel very last century. <laughs> so, all new interior. Um, as you can see, we changed the, orientation of the main screen, so it's easier to watch movies and that kind of thing um, in landscape. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I mean, in other notes, we have ventilated front seats. <laughs> so, yeah, anyway, it's, I think it's, a, it's really, it, you drive around and it really feels like, okay, we're in 2021, great. 
Um, we, we have the, this yoke steering wheel, which is a little different, but I think once you try it, you'll think this is, it's, it's great. Um, the, you, your, the visibility uh, of the, the, the main screen is, is super clear, especially for uh, autopilot. So you can see the entire panoramic view of, you can basically see the mind's eye of the car. Um, and uh, yeah, it's, it's really cool. <laughs> so, and then we've gotten rid of the stalks. So, like, you know, I think generally um, all input is error. So we, we want, if, if you have to do something that the car could have done already, uh, that should be taken care of. The software should just do it. So you can actually just literally walk up to the car, it senses that you're approaching, unlocks the car based on your phone, it just basically pairs with your phone, knows that you're coming to the car, opens the door, it op op extends the handle, you sit down, and you just drive. You don't, you don't have to uh, press the drive or anything like that. The car knows you want to drive. It figures like, yeah, good guess, you know? <laughs> so, and, and, then, and then it's using the autopilot system to know where the obstacles are. So obviously if there's something in front of you, you want to go backwards, and if there's something in, in, uh, you know, in back of you, you want to most likely, um, <laughs> and then it'll, 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 it will adapt to your, uh, to, to your needs. So if it sees that you're always doing, uh, this, you know, you're changing to reverse or forward in particular situations, it'll try to remember that um, and ge geocode it to that location. So then you it, it'll you won't have to do it in the future. It'll it will just keep uh, minimizing the amount of input that you need to do until the car just reads your mind. So it's it's got uh, uh, Inductive, uh, dual inductive charges uh, for your phones in the back and dual inductive in the, uh, in the front. Um, and it's, got, it's a 36 watt power supply, so you can actually charge like your you know, laptop or anything, basically it's got it's a 36 watt uh, USB-C. Yeah. And then the 17 inch touchscreen is, it feels like a, a movie theater, the, the sound is incredible. Um, <laughs> and um, yeah, so you can really, it, 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 it's, it's like a home theater experience. So if you're, if you're sitting somewhere waiting or for whatever reason or at a supercharger, uh, you can just catch up on what are your, your favorite Netflix show or iTunes or whatever the case may be, YouTube. Um, and of course, uh, you can also play video games. So, and, and the same thing for the rear. So you can, uh, rear, it, it, it basically, the, the system feeds all three screens. Um, and so you can do things the front, rear, it's great. Um, uh, we, we have an old new uh, sound system designed by Tesla Audio um, with, uh, and we have acoustic glass throughout the car. So the car is very quiet when going down the highway, even at very high speeds, like you're like doing like 100 miles an hour, still quiet. Yeah. <laughs> um, and th this is a Tesla designed uh, codec, so uh, it will keep uploading improved versions uh, of the sound system. It's, it's, it's completely software defined. So we'll keep tweaking it and dynamically adjusting to whether uh, you're using uh, so streaming or whether it's coming via Bluetooth from your phone or uh, different streaming services. Uh, it'll actually, and if, if the data rate changes, it'll adapt that. So basically, it always sounds good. Um, and that's just going to get better. So, yeah. And then, uh, <laughs> it's not PS. Not PS4, it's PS5. <laughs> so um, there's, I think never, there really there's never been a car that has state-of-the-art uh, computing technology, state-of-the-art infotainment, where uh, this is literally uh, at the level of a, of a PlayStation 5. So yeah, I mean, if you think about the future where the car is often uh, in autopilot or full self-driving mode, um, then entertainment is going to become increasingly important. Um, so you're going to want to watch movies, play games, um, you know, use, use the internet, uh, just all the thing, you know, things you want to do if you're not driving. And this is uh, actual PlayStation 5 level performance. Yes. So. All right, and deliveries begin now. Yeah. So, so we're, we're in production. Uh, we're going to deliver the first uh, 25 cars now. and. Uh, uh, and then basically we should be at, uh, you know, several hundred cars per week soon and a thousand cars a week probably next quarter. So 
Uh, please enjoy. Uh, we put a lot of work into this. Uh, I'd like to, to thank the incredible work of the Tesla engineering and production teams. Uh, a, you know, so like, my hat is off to Tesla engineering, production, design, the whole, the whole, the whole group. Uh, they really they put their uh, heart and soul into this, so I uh, hope, hope you enjoy it. So let's uh, deliver some cars. All right.